Hello, Strawberry. Hello, Henry. Uh, we had a session on the RX1, our Rock Siva today. How was your experience? Well, I want to do it again. Yeah. Yeah, I'll definitely do it again. It's, um, I don't know. It's just, uh, it's just really good. It's, uh, it's kind of like there's no negative about it. At first, the light was strong, mm -hmm. but then you know, we didn't have flashing lights in our faces all the time. And uh, and then it, it was, it, it's kind of like um, if you don't mind me saying this, but you know if you've ever taken mushrooms to sort your head out or or even no actually we'll come off that but when you were a kid and you and your folks put you on the slide and you held on to the slide you didn't want to let go because whoa that, that's quite steep down there but mm -hmm. when you finally let go it was like wow and that was kind of like this you know so you just lie back and you just and you go with the flow. Um, and the lights and uh, the patterns and the way the, the music controlled the lights it was also it was it was almost like a sound to light and the and the weird patterns kind of like I've never seen I don't, I don't think I've uh, seen these patterns before maybe maybe like you know because I looked at the tree of life on you and then of course your subconscious mind takes that in and then of course it throws it into yeah. you know but uh, no it was nothing threatening no 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 weirdness M music was beautiful uh, God, I don't know what else to say. <laughs> how do you feel now compared to before you went under um, well you know I feel like I want to go and tell the world about it really <laughs> and, you know if, if there's a session to be had like you know it, it's like something if you were uh, if you've never had acupuncture before which I had I've never had done this year mm. and um, and then I had it and I'm thinking wow I'm telling people like it's a new thing since life's bread and this is kind of like the same lie back and uh, just uh, just you let, let your thoughts if you've got any bad thoughts I can imagine this if this if you've got any bad thoughts lie back and it was kind of like it's a bit like one of my yoga classes if you when you come to my yoga class I'll tell you to leave all your troubles at the door mm -hmm. and if they really mean much to you they'll be there when you come back but I assure you nine times out of ten there's nothing that can when you leave my class, you know, so it's, it's, this is it doesn't just make, make you feel good. So you can see the potential in helping, like the, the mindfulness and the, you know more meditation. Can you yeah. can you see that benefit? Yeah, definitely, definitely. You know, because you know, like sometimes, or most of the times, I listen to a bit of music and someone's trying to meditate me, and all I want to do is fall asleep. Mm. This is not, you know. And another thing, you know, like uh, when when. It, my mind got conditioned quite quickly because sometimes I thought the light wasn't even there and then I realised it was still flicking away in places. Yeah, so, I always explain that you relax into it basically. Yeah, that's right, yeah, yeah, yeah you condition your mind to it. Right. So, uh, yeah, and, um, yeah I, I feel good, yeah, I don't, you know, I'm a person, I would tell you the truth if I, uh, if I, if I thought it was a load of number of jumbo, I would just say, yeah, it was all right, but you know, if you're into that kind of thing. But no, I I, re I would recommend someone. You know, you've got things playing on your mind or anything like that. I think that can help untie the knots. Do you know what I'm saying? No, I appreciate your honesty and your time. So thanks for trying out today. No, thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you.